high base, yeah. and then I just go down. So you can see here, there's just a little hole. You see that? Next step, now I would do all, all of them before I move on to the next drill, but I'm just trying to show you so that you can do. So now, this is the This is the access drill. It's going to uh, be like a counterboard drill. So the tip of this fits into this hole, and then it's going to follow that trajectory. But it is a cutting tip. So if you're like using this hand and kind of going like this, then you can redirect it. So what I teach is grab the hand piece like this, put your finger on the tie base. Don't worry. You can't go through the tie base, but you want to counter the pressure. I'm going to start off with it just lightly in there, and then I'm going to start the start the uh, hand piece, and then I'm going to push down with that finger. Okay, so this hand is steady, and this finger is pushing down. Now, eventually, if you do enough of this, you'll join the club. And you'll have a callus on this finger <laughs> for all the times that you felt the tip. It won't go through, it won't hurt you, but you'll feel it. Initially, it'll shock you until you're used to it, but don't worry, it's not going to hurt you. And then after you've done that, these pin vices have a collet and there's another one on the back side here, right? So you have four different diameter choices for what this can hold on to. So I just made sure that it was set on the collet that will hold this third drill, which is called the clearance drill. Then I'm going to tighten that down by finger, finger tightening. And then I'm going to go down here. Now this is the important thing for you to know. All I'm doing is trying to create a path for the head of that septal fastener to come out. It might come out on the drill. If that happens, cool. If it doesn't happen, no big deal. There are other ways to get it out. Okay? But I'm going to start just kind of turning that, that drill without any pressure. And then I'm going to just slowly add more pressure. And you see I'm countering the pressure with my, my pointer finger because I don't want to punch that tie base out. Okay? So I'm countering the pressure, just creating a, a, a pathway there. And then you might see that I lean into the buckle a little bit, lean into the distal, the lingual, the mesial, just expand that hole a little bit more. And then you'll see, look at what came out. The head of the septal fastener. 